Hey everybody, I'm To, and today I'm going to show you how the new 3S XL works. And let me just, here, here's mine. Uh, I, have, I have Yoshi protection, you know, so it will not break. And let me just open it. There you go. Now let me just, so th today I'm going to show you how this system works. It's on. You can see it's on. Let me just wait. Okay, there you go. So basically, uh, how it works is right there. You have an infrared sensor. It's 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 that thing. It's this 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 little thing right here. And that will only turn on if you're in a really dark place. And the main thing is the C stick, which is you can see it's right there. And the reason and the thing for C stick is watch. I'll show you by going in Smash Bros. for 3DS. Let me just press Smash Bros. for 3DS. There you go. Eh. Oh yeah, and also this system has has faster processing power, so I think you'll start Smash Bros. in less than like 20 seconds. Press any button. Okay, I'm gonna press eight. The eight. I'm gonna press the 8 button. There you go. Oh wait, <laughs> the volume's not on. Okay. Now, this, so what, the C, what the C stick is for is... It's for advanced control, so basically I'm just gonna go to training. Wait, uh, 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 I'm gonna just use it. Solo training. Alright, and let me just pick Kirby, because I like Kirby. Kirby. And just random. And just a random opponent. And then just pick random stage. And you can see there's, there's a little tip right there. It's about the stage. Okay, it seems I'm battling zero to seven. So, okay. And let me just put three opponents. Okay, there you go. Three opponents. And you can tell there's only two, but the the, the other one's up there. <laughs> Pretty sure you can't see. Okay. Now I'm gonna test out the C stick by going near this zero to seven person. Okay. All right. I'm right here. I'm right here. And now let me just press the C stick to the side end. Wait. And look, you're actually punching by using the C stick. And 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 if you put the C stick up, you actually. Hit an up one, a down one, or yeah. Well, you can't. You cannot use a C stick to move. So yep, that's all. So and yep. Also, the start and um, starting select buttons were moved from here over here, like the regular DSi and DS games or DS consoles. And you can see that the Zero Damage has 64 damage. <laughs> So basically, that's how the C stick works. You just move it in the direction you want to go, and you actually punch instead of using these buttons and the and the circle pad. So yeah, the C stick's pretty cool. Oh yeah, and the C stick can also be used on the home menu. Look, look, look. See, I'm pressing the C stick, and it's moving. And you can see how it is right now. And there's a camera. Basically, basically the C stick can only be used in the home menu and in games. It cannot be used in Meme Maker, I think, and the other ones. And basically, that's how the new 36 cell works. So, thank you guys for watching. And my next video is gonna be how the how the Nintendo DSi works. Okay. And after that, I'm gonna show you how the new 3DS works. And after that, I'm gonna sh I'm gonna do a little comparison to all those three gaming consoles, okay? Well, yeah. As you can see, the A, B, Y, and X buttons are colored. The A is red, the B is yellow, the Y is green, and the X is blue. Also, you can see that that the control pad is a little bit higher than on the regular 3DS. Usually, the regular 3DS is like right here. So they moved it a little bit higher for better comfort. And there's the volume, 3D screen. I'm pretty. Oh yeah. Can you see? Can, can you guys see the 3D? No, no, you can't. Now, 
Now you can see the speakers right there, and you can see that the LED, if it turns orange, have a friend online. Also, if uh, right, right here you can see the power buttons, that means on, and that's, that's wireless. And there's the mic, you can barely see it, and there's a home menu button. And it'll show you your steps and everything like, like the regular 3DS, but if I close it, turn it around, you can see that there's the pen stylus, there's the headphone, and there's the, S and there's the game card. If you turn it around, you can see there is a C stick, or oh, the C stick is inside. That's the Z, that's the Z R one. That's a ZL, ZL right here. And basically, the R and the L ones like like on the regular one. And here you can see the cameras right there. Now I'm just open it again. And and that's basically just it. I think. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You could also put in Amiibo on it. Um, in my next video, I'm gonna do the. I'm gonna do the. And my thing next two videos, I'm gonna do a comparison, and I'm gonna bring my uh, Luigi Amiibo to try it on on Smash Bros. Okay. So basically, that is it. Now I'll just. I'll just be turning it off. And let me just press the off button, and there we go. Thank you guys for watching, and if you have one. And if you have one, I hope this will be very useful. But if you don't, I suggest that you go get one because because it has a lot of cool things. It's this this 3DS XL is actually like like 1.23 inches bigger. I don't know than the the regular 3DS XL. Basically, they had that. They have the same yeah the same screen size as the 3DS XL and the same screen size same screen size too. And right there, I can see it's off. There's the mic and everything that you need. So yeah. Okay, everybody, that's all. So see you later. I'm just gonna go play it right now. Ugh. Yay! I'm playing it.